Hey guys, welcome back to the House of Wrinkles, bringing you the how-to for English Bulldogs and other canine tips and tricks. Today we want to talk to you about your runt. Runts suffer from something called failure to thrive, and we want to give you some tips and some tricks on how to help your runt survive. Um, so this is little Mercedes. She weighs seven ounces. 21 kilograms. We are um, weighing her every day. Of course, we're weighing them all every day. You want to do that. But um, when you have a runt like that, you really want to monitor them um, more extensively. So we're weighing her in kilograms because obviously she's so little, she's not going to gain ounces every day. Okay, so when you have a runt like that, what you want to do is they're not able to suck as strong as they need to in order to get enough milk. So, a lot of times their, their blood sugar will drop. And when their blood sugar drops, they get weaker and weaker, which makes the situation even worse. They're not strong enough to actually suck to get the milk. So, that's where this comes in. This is Cairo syrup. This is a very thick syrupy substance and it's basically sugar. Um, and what this does is it brings their blood sugar up so that they get their strength back and they get more alert. So if you see one of your puppies um, that's sleeping a lot and it's not, a, it's not very alert, then chances are you probably need to get some Cairo. So we always keep this on hand. You don't want to give them much at all. You just want to barely give them a little bit. So what I usually do is just kind of put my pinky in there, the tip of my pinky. And so you can see here, just got a little bit on my pinky. All right, so I'm just gonna try to open her mouth here. Sometimes they don't want to open their mouth. Come on. So basically you just have to get it. Uh, they don't have to suck on your finger or anything like that. Sometimes they will because it tastes really good to them. <laughs> but as long as you get it in their mouth, that does the trick. And um, this is also used to help them use the bathroom. A lot of times the runts um, have a hard time. They get constipated very easily. So the Cairo is supposed to help with that as well. And um, you really want to keep a close eye on your runts. They, um, they get weak very quickly and it can go downhill real quick. So um, you want to make sure they're eating. And they're, a lot of times it'll look like they're eating, but they're not actually, they're just got their mouth around it and they're not actually sucking anything out. So she's worried about her baby. <laughs> so you have to make sure they're getting what they need and also make sure they're using the bathroom like they're supposed to. So it usually takes just a few minutes and the Cairo will perk them back up pretty quickly. Um, and if that doesn't work, then you wanna do bottle feeding. Now, naturally the mama's milk is much more nutritious than um, pu puppy replacement milk, but um, that's an option because with a bottle, you can actually see how much they're intaking and when they feed off their mom, you can't. So a bottle is also um, a good idea with runs. So just to let you know, with Mercedes, she has not got to the lethargic stage. Um, we just noticed that she wasn't as strong when she sucks. So we're not worried about her at this point. She still seems like she's still uh, crying loud. She's still getting around really good. She seems strong, but she just wasn't sucking as hard enough. So. You can ideally, if you have a puppy that's lethargic that you're really worried about, you can give this to them um, every three to four hours. Um, usually you don't have to do that because it works. It, you know, it really does work. It's a lifesaver. But with, um, with Mercedes, we're just doing it like once or twice a day at this point just to try to get her a little bit 
stronger and um, hopefully get her gaining weight because she's she has gained a kilogram but that's about all she's gained since birth which is not ideal you really you want them to gain um, about three percent of their body weight each day that's why we weigh them so between two and six kilograms a day is is a good uh, average if you have a runt that you're having trouble with and you have questions please message us um, and we appreciate all of your support and your prayers for Miss Mercedes. We really are hopeful for her. So keep watching. Um, hit the like, share, and subscribe button. Also the bell button to be notified of our future videos. And we'll see you next time. Say goodbye. Say bye-bye.